my my basic view is that there's not sort of uh, old and new music. There's good and bad music, <laughs> and uh, Blossom is a very special space. Um, you know when I. When I took on uh, the job here, I was not knowing Blossom. I was very suspicious because I thought, oh God, open air and, and so on. And the first time I went there, I really fell in love with it because it's, the setting is not only beautiful, but the acoustics are fantastic in Blossom. I think really, I don't know every open air venue in this country, but from my experience, it's by far, by miles, the best, acoustically best open air venue there is. I've never experienced any better. And, um, and I think that it, it has a sort of, when, when you're on stage, uh, also it has this sort of a little church feeling, <laughs> you know, the way it's built. And I think, um, that's also why Messiaen is perfect in there. And, and I think with the nature around it and, uh, the arts and especially music, uh, there are similarities, uh, or parallels to nature. When you go into nature, you know, it's, it's to find stillness, to find relaxation in a in a higher sense if you want and i think that's why why this festival's uh, blossom should not only be you know playing the popular tunes and that's fine you know but actually giving audiences also that experience um w which is sort of becoming one, the music, the nature, all together. Because it, I, for my feeling, it's really a very, very special place. You know, the first time I did the Bruckner Symphony, uh, it was the, the, the acoustics are a little boomier than, than here in Severance Hall when you're on stage. And so this sort of, again, church feeling, uh, and, uh, the, this piece at the Expector, uh, was first performed in a church and was written for a church in Paris. Um, so I think it, it does fit in extremely well into Blossom. The instrumentation of it, Expecto is, is, uh, winds and percussion, uh, no strings. And it, it has this, like the end, this unbelievable, mighty feeling. You know, it's, it's overwhelming. It's really beautifully overwhelming. And like always in Messiaen's music, this sort of on the lighter side, um, he always writes these, um, bird songs and you know about the birds in blossom you know before they settle down so even after it got dark and and we play that so we sort of continue what nature provides out there <laughs>